you see it. I know you see it because anything with red, black, and white, I feel like always screams Sephora. Anyway, if you think my voice is like, ooh, how fancy. It is not fancy. I just was at BeautyCon LA. Uh, we were talking a lot, may I just say. And I lost my voice, kind of. Like, kind of, you know what I mean? Like, it's still there, but it's just like, hello, you know what I mean? It's like, what? Do you see what I mean? Anywho, oh my gosh, are we ready? Oh, Sephora play. Oh my gosh, this is this is August. It's gonna be Christmas. <gasps> no, it's not, it's not good. It's not that close. But still, anywho, I can't believe the year has flown by so much. This is a ten dollar subscription service. If you didn't know that, but this is Sephora play. Oh, ooh, what? this looks like a what? This looks so familiar. Why can't I put my finger on it? Anywho, yes, it's kind of cute. Anywho, uh, this is the little like booklet, but I want to kind of keep it a surprise. <gasps> There's glass in here. Um, but I want to kind of keep it a surprise. That's the reason I want to look at this. But let's open it. What is this? I love this stuff actually. <gasps> I'm so excited. Okay, so this is the uh, Living Proof Dry Shampoo. Uh, I love this. When I travel, I feel like it's the perfect little size. I'm actually going to be going to a wedding in like a month. So, uh, you know, I can fly these in a, a nice way. And they will not throw this away at TSA. So, yeah, I can just like spray this in my hair and give it some volume. The only thing is I remember last time I used it, I, I kind of like an itchy like feeling. I'm not sure exactly why. Ooh, there's a lot of interesting ingredients in here. Yeah, it's small. It's a strong smell. I just like blew on you. I'm like, <laughs> anyway, um, it smells actually really good, but it, there is like fragrance and some uh, not some great ingredients in here, but it's really good. So I am excited about that. And it's a nice size. Like you pay twelve dollars for this at checkout um, at Sephora. Uh, then we have a what? This is a Kat Von D perfume. I've never. Oh my gosh, this uh, dry shampoo stuff is getting in my throat. <laughs> Okay, anywho, oh my, oh, how cool, there's two scents, there's the black and the white one. Oh, that's a nice, like very subtle scent, well, how do they describe it? It's dreamy and, yeah, dreamy, that's the main like description of it. Um, then we have the black one, which is dark. Ooh, ooh, this, the black one smells kind of like, almost like a, like an earthy, like, fresh, ooh, I like these both, these are really good. So good job, Kat Von D, I don't know how to describe them. But they smell actually just really good. I feel like there's like a good perfume and there's a bad perfume. That's a good one. I see something else from Kat Von D. Oh my gosh, this is a locket concealer. How cool, I'm actually so excited. Ooh, it's actually like a nice, it's almost like a spot on color. It's a little lighter, but I don't mind that. Ooh, it feels really nice actually. That's like the perfect shade. They did actually a really good job. I'm really excited about it. It's such a cute little tube too. This could be cool. I'm actually kind of really cons can 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 serious. What? Can can uh, curious about this concealer? Can serious? No. Um. Anyway, I'm really excited about this. This is so amazing. I love this month so far. We have a baby beauty blender, the mini one, probably to go with the concealer. How adorable though. So that's really cute. And it's by Beauty Blender. <laughs> beauty Blender is very expensive. Um. Then we have this Melt Off Mascara from Too Faced. Oh my god, I just said that name. It says it's made in the US, but they also have a China lab. And it's just, they're kind of two-faced, you know what I mean? Um, so yeah, I just, I don't like to talk about them a lot, but if you like them, hey, just enjoy it. But I'm just, and I don't, I'm not very excited about that product. <gasps> but then, oh, this is the Brazilian Bum Bum Cream. You don't use it on your butt, but it's like supposed to be like tightening. And uh, I've heard really good things about this. This is an amazing month. Oh my god. <gasps> this is so cool. Oh my gosh, I want to smell this. That smells so good. It's like a fruity, warm dream. That was so surprisingly good. I am so happy. Really, really good. I haven't gotten this good of a month from Sephora Play in a while. I know a lot of people say that Sephora Play is just a bunch of testers. And that actually kind of concerns me because this thing was open before I actually like used it like I no I actually didn't even squirt it on my hand I literally just smelled it um so yeah I don't know let me know your kind of thought about it because I don't know maybe it is just testers I don't think so maybe some things are like maybe this I don't know but it smells really good so I don't know do you think all of Sephora Play stuff is testers let me know that's a big I don't know thing going on YouTube but I don't know let me know what you think in the comments I'm I'm kind of 50 50 on it as I have gotten definitely used products from Sephora Play. Um, but, Depa Doodle, I love you so much. Thank you so much for watching and bye. See you tomorrow.